So we're back. Hi, doll friends, we're back. We have just a few little things that we need to talk about today. Um, one thing I wanna point out to you is that when you get your uh, packets, those of you that ordered our packets of fabric, on piece number four, you are going to notice that it's a different cut than what we have here. This is a cut based on whatever fabric anybody would want to use. It's just an easier size to work with. However, yours is going to be a different shape. And the reason being is you want to have your um, file lines, the, the, these lines that go back and forth on the silk file, you want to have them horizontal. Um, so make sure you do that. Otherwise, it's not going to fit on the pattern piece and it's not going to be right. So that's not why we're really here today, though. What we're here today is because someone is just too fast. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. <laughs> so we've had some people and some very advanced sewers that said, he did it too fast. So we're going to do the trim again, but we're going to do it in slow motion, right? So we're Look, doing... Look, okay. slow motion, yes. Yes, yeah, slow. Yeah. <laughs> So here we have our two pieces for our trim. Here is a piece of the finished trim. Can you hold that? Because it's turning there. So that's, that's what we want. Uh, we have found that for both size patterns, whether you're doing the full size or the small size, both of the size works for both. So let's do this. Okay. We have the acro uh, trim that I'm going to fold in half, pressing it, of course. So we'll show it, Michael. So we're pressing it in This half. is an inch wide by, uh, should be 26. Okay. And you're just folding it right in half and pressing it down. I should be over here, maybe I get it better. So it's just folding it in half and it'll pop back up, but that's not gonna matter because it'll, it's gonna get sewn down. And this piece in your kit, these are cut on the bias, which is a huge undertaking to do. And it's a huge fabric waster. Yes, totally a fabric waster. Absolutely. Okay. Yep. That's why they didn't use it much in the... So I'm going to come around to this side because it'll be <coughs> easier. Okay. Right. We have our blue, our... Um, Hot pink trim. And if you bought the um, Unforgettable, this is the color that it is. So this is cut at two inches. And in your package, you'll get these at two inches. Although in the uh, video, the first one we did it at an uh, inch and, and um, three, three quarters. quarters. You can trim it down to an inch and three quarters, but you think it's better at an inch. It's um, uh, two inches. Two inches, I'm yeah. sorry. Yeah. Two inches. Uh, one and three quarters works, two, but uh, two will be better, okay? And, and if you bought a, the, the packets from us, they all come in a two inch cut. So and it's okay. all cut on the vibes. I'm just placing this, uh, the acro trim, right on the. On it can be on, it's on either uh, side of the... Um, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Okay, we have it in place. Okay. okay. And I'm going to continue. Okay, one, uh, as you can see on this side, it should be like an eighth, okay? So basically the uh, sewing needle of the machine will go right in the center of the uh, air crew trim. So it's going right in the center. Right in the center.
And this is the only sewing we are doing on this. So it's that one seam, that's it. That's it. Okay, so <clears throat> now I'm going to trim the excess of this um, uh, from the um, stitching that I did. It's going to be an inch, uh, excuse me, it's going to be an eighth of an inch. So I'm going to kind of eyeball it, kind of like so. I think this is a better site, Michael, uh, filming it, and the ladies will have a better perspective of what we're doing. There, it's not like the other time. Um, you mean were, when you made it in four and a half minutes? Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. But this, this trim technique, once you've got it, it's something that you can use on so many different designs. Yeah, you're gonna love it and you're gonna continue making it. Okay, so we have that. And now I'm, I'm gonna go to the um, iron presser and now uh, I'm gonna show you what's next. I'm just, I'm just gonna do a little press in here. Okay. Okay. I'm sweating, Michael. It's, it's, <laughs> it's stressful. It's, it's stressful. Okay, as you can see, I'm going to turn this upside down like so. Yeah. And I'm just gonna kind of play it a little with my fingers. Finger well, press it. Finger press it a little bit. This alone, just like this, was a, 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 a 1870s, 1880s um, way of um, trimming dresses, just right there. Okay, the next thing you'll do, flip it around like so, and then you're gonna go like this. One more time. Okay, one more time. Making sure you have here like a quarter of an inch um, width uh, on this pink side of the uh, trim. Is that a quarter of an inch or is that an eighth of an inch? <clears throat> I think it's. I think it's mm, let's see. Let's, okay. let's measure it because they're going to want to know exactly. Oh, okay. here it's well, on me. Pull it off of me. <clears throat> okay, I'll tell you what. You don't need to measure it. Because you, the measurement of the width, you already have it here. Right. The seam allowance. And when you turn it around like that, that's your measurement. Okay, that's it. Okay. All right, so then so that's for, an eighth. That's, yeah. People, I designed the trim the first time, and mine was much more complicated to do. So Jose's is... So they said, oh no, yours is too, yours is too much. So, we're doing it this It was not too much, it, it was not that it was too much. Um, um, this is easier. It, 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 yes. Okay, let me just, okay, maybe a little more pressing here. You don't want to squash this down too much with the iron. No. No. Okay. All right. So now that we have it like, like this, what you're going to do next, you're going to fold this excess right here, up mm -hmm. here. You're going to fold it over like so, mm -hmm. side to side of that. Right. Okay. I'm going to make sure if that's the width I want. That should give you about a quarter of an inch. Okay, I'm gonna press this down like so.
And there we go. Okay, that's what you want. All right, okay. so that looks great. All right, and now I'm gonna bring it over here. I'm going to pin this in place. Okay, I'm just gonna pin this much because I'm just gonna show you the next step, the very last step of this, and you, uh, your trim is ready to be placed on the dress. Okay, we have it like so. Oh I God, did it. I'm impressed. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't do that if it gave me a million dollars. Okay, you just gotta make sure that this part right here is folded all the way down. Why? Because I'm going to do some um, blind stitching right here just to hold that in place. And you're going down into the to the ditch. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. So no, no, those seams will never stitches will never be seen. And that's it. You'll do it all the way along the uh, the width, which the, the length is 26 inches. So you'll do it all the way, okay? And there's your trim. That's it. All right. Thank you. Of course. That's wonderful. I hope okay. everyone. I hope this helps everybody. Um, one thing I think that is, if you, I think the two inch size is good for the larger pattern, but if you're going to do the smaller, I'd go. Uh, an inch and a third. I think it would just make a better... An inch and three quarters. Or inch and three quarters, yeah. yeah. Inch and three quarters. See, because it would be just a tiny bit smaller. Yeah. Yeah. Just so... We did the big one just so that you have a better look of what we're doing. But you're, so you're, that's when the you idea. Get your, when you get your bundle, you can do it the two inches. And then if you're doing it for the smaller doll, I, we would suggest that you cut it down to... Uh, uh, one and a third, and then the same same with the, the echo. No, one and three quarters. Or one and three quarters, <laughs> I'm sorry. One and three quarters. Yep. Yeah. yeah. So two, if you're doing the bigger, one, one and three, three quarters. quarters, and this is for the colored material. That yep. will be in your, in your bundles. All right, friends. I hope, good luck with this. Bye-bye.